Good morning, traders. I uh, have been doing some trading this morning. <laughs> Not been doing too good, but uh, I just lost, accidentally lost the video that I was recording. So I've started the video back up again. Try not to hit the delete button this time. And um, what I'm doing now is, uh, well, the code two uh, has changed today uh, for this week. So I have to retrack it again. Um, I've been I've been getting you know chopped up in here, and I I want to trade, lose trade, want to trade, lose trade. <laughs> I can't get anywhere today except for I did did just win a good trade here on this break. Now I'm reevaluating it, and it looks like yes, I can see the code two now. So the, hold on a second, let me see if it's reached its range yet or not, and I'm gonna take another entry. I'll be right back. Okay, it has not reached its range. It's got uh, it's got a little ways to go. It's got about well, it depends if it's tight yet today. But it probably won't be tight today. It'll probably go up the full range, even maybe higher. So that gives it a good 40 more ticks, possibly 50. No, 50 more ticks from right here. So let's see if I can get a code one entry. Uh, the code one did just change. Uh, it's a lot better. There's a lot better on the change here. On the last, uh, the last code one was offset everywhere, and it was offset. So it was pretty tough. I was getting chopped. It was offset in this chop. They see they use the offsets in these in these chop areas. Oh man, it's like double whammy. Anyway, I'm looking for a code one entry. It should be good. I'm going to take it. It's probably going to be long. Code 2 is long and it's got about 40 ticks to go from right here. 50 ticks even. Possibly more. Be right back. Okay, it's moving up into the... Uh, it's not giving me an entry here yet. I hope it doesn't go too high. Stop going up. Oh. See, I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for a precision level code one entry here standby okay I have gotten a code one short entry let's see if I can get a few ticks from this I'm only looking for about maybe 10 15 ticks from this because the code let's say 10 ticks because the code two is to go long not short so and it hasn't reached its range yet so it should go up more this is just a little quickie right here to get a quick 10 ticks hopefully off of a code one short entry. Be right back. Okay, limit has been set. Stand by. Limit order has been set at 4302 for just a quick 10 ticks. Be right back. Hopefully it'll get me out before it reverses and goes back the other way because it's going to go up because it's a uh, co code two is to go long. So what I'm hoping it will do is come down, get me out for the 10, right? And then turn around and give me a long entry at, at some point to go long. I'm going to take the first long entry I get. And then boom, going back long again. Because code 2 is to go long. It's not reached its range yet. So this is somewhat of a dangerous trade right here. Let me go calculate the stop and place it. Be right back. Okay, and this is actually a big stop too, which I don't like. Uh... 43, 23 on the stop, it's 11 ticks. I don't really, 10 tick on the exit, 11 tick on the stop, that's not good. I'm going to get out of this trade. Okay, I have just exited this trade. It's not a good mathematical trade. First of all, I I took a short position. Code 2 says it's going to go long. Not not a good idea to begin with. Um, second of all, the stop was 11 or ticks and the, and the profit is only 10 ticks that's not good math you always want to have a uh, one-to-one -one or or better and this is not good mathematics so what I'm doing now is I'm looking for a code one long entry which is what I should have done to begin with just be patient and wait to go into the code two trade code two is to go long again it has not reached its range yet it should go higher. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm looking for a code one entry. Stand by. Should have held on to that last short. It did make it to my 10 ticks. 
Okay, let's see if I can get a long entry here. See what it's going to do. This thing is really choppy. Up and down, up and down. Okay, I've just taken a long position here. It's a code one long entry. I'll be right back and set a stop. Okay, I've got the stop placed at 42.97. So that is 12 ticks. Okay. It should just take off and go. Remember, code two is to, is to go long. And I just took a code one long entry into the code two. This is how you do it. Okay, I'll be right back. It's rolling over here. Looks like it's going to come down and get me. That's what it's been doing it to me all day today. It's crazy. It's a crazy day today. It's tough. Real tough day. It's just, it's too shallow, too tight, too slow. And the code just, it's just, you know, it's not a good day. It's too slow. And it really needs to open up. I guess we're just in the wrong month. <laughs> August. Alright, I'm going to get a signal here. Let's see what this thing says. Okay, we have another code one long signal. So that makes two of them right next to the top here. So it should go up and break that top, no problem now. And go higher. Plus, remember I said the code two is to go long. So that's the perfect setup. Two code one long entries right next to the top with a code two backing it up to go long. It's just going to go up now. So now I just need to know where my exit's going to be, uh, which I sort of know. Uh, I'm basically going to take it up to, I'm going to try to shoot for 60. So that'll give me 51 ticks. 51 tick trade, hit it at uh, 4360 on the exit. I'll be right back. Okay, this thing is so slow and tight today. That I have set the exit on this to 43.50, which is fairly conservative. That would be like 90. I should do 10 more ticks down, actually. Just go for 40. Mm. I'll give it a little more time, see if it wants to take a break here and really move up and shoot up. But I'll just take the 50. It's just going to be a small trade today. It's not been an easy day, and I didn't know what the code 2 was. They've changed it, so I've got to track it now. And uh, it's by tracking it that I can nail it. And today they definitely changed it. So Anyway, uh, tomorrow I'll come out and nail it. And uh, today, you know, I just had it wrong, that's all. Anyway. I'll be back. Okay, I have reversed position here because we have a code one short entry. Uh, I'm just going to go for a quick 10 ticks. I'll place the stop and the exit. I'll be right back. Okay, I've got the exit at 42.99 for 10 ticks, and I've got the stop at uh, 43.16 for 7 tick stop. Math is better now. Okay, uh, I'll be right back. And also, the code 2 is still to go long, so I'm looking for a long entry. I'm going to take another long entry here and uh, go with it. But right now, it wants to give another short, so let's see if I can grab 10 ticks out of it. Last time I gave up on it, could have had the 10 ticks. As you can see, it's tough trading today. It's very tight, very choppy, very slow. It's not at all an easy day today. In fact, I'm about ready just to give up on it today and just call it a day for trading because it's so it's just too slow. Seriously, it's August, it's summer, it's just too slow right now. It needs to open up a bit more, which it could start doing at any time, but today is not the day to do it. That's for sure. Be right back. Okay, I just exited that trade. It's just too choppy and it's just it's not getting any range anywhere. Um I'm probably going to take another trade here shortly, but maybe not. It's just too slow. And the code to, let me see here. It's possible even the code to's range is, is you know, just going to be tight. And that's going to be it. If that's the case, it's not going to do much. 
you know it's just really tight I've been trading now for a while <laughs> I'm still down I can't get anywhere it's just it's just you know it's no good today it's not good I think I'm just gonna call it a bad day today and just uh, stop trading and hopefully tomorrow will be better because uh, it's atrocious out there today at least tomorrow I'm gonna know what the code 2 is I can come out and nail the entry at least whereas today they definitely changed it I got the entry wrong that's one of the reasons why I'm down anyway I'm gonna watch it for a little while longer I might take an entry if not I'll just come back and wrap it up and call it a day that's what most likely what I'm gonna do just call it a day too slow for me see how slow it's trading I'll be back okay just wanted to come back really quick and show that I am done trading for the day I'm gonna wrap it up and I'll be back tomorrow to do some more trading I'll hit the code 2 tomorrow do the tracking later today in the charting service and I'll know what the code 2 will be and then I'll be able to should be able to nail it tomorrow like I normally can and um, hopefully this market's gonna open up some today actually it's not no it is bad the range is really bad today and it's just choppy and slow this is not a good day for trading I mean the code is okay it's just really really tight but it's working it's just really tight I mean I could be trading it but it's also a bit offset here and there it's it's just tricky today it's not a good day and therefore I'm just gonna call it a bad day call it a losing day and I'll move on to tomorrow gotta learn how to do that as a trader I don't want to push bad days there's no reason for it give you a different perspective on where we are this is the daily chart look at the look at where we are a line going up a line going down and we're sitting right in the middle of those two lines you know I mean we're just sitting on a fence here chopping up and down we're not going a green bar going up we're not doing a red bar going down we're chopping up and down in the middle here and it's it's tough it's tough so it's just not a good day today simple as that not every day can be a good day to trade anyway so I'll do the charting service in a little while later today we'll have it tracked we'll nail it tomorrow and uh, hopefully it'll def hopefully it'll pick up I doubt it was gonna stay like this for much longer it'll start to pick up or at least one day will be active and hit you know hit the, the ticks the next day be slow but at least that today is really slow so hopefully tomorrow will be more active okay I'll be back tomorrow happy trading out there traders Hope you did better than me today. See you tomorrow.